guys, Sparkles, and welcome back to my channel. Don't forget to give a giant thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I know I said that I wasn't going to talk about this, but I'm going to talk about it. Brit Smith is on to something. She has now released her song, Karma is a B word, after Jojo Siwa released it. And she wrote the song, Brit Smith wrote the song way back in 2012. And now it's 2024 and it's top three. Like, top three. She never, she never released it in 2012, and I'm not sure why, she just never did. She just never released it up until now. And now is the perfect time to release it because Jojo Siwa has already released it. But now she, the artist, gets to release it, and I love it. I'm not sure why or how Jojo Siwa got the rights to release it, I'm not sure, but I like, I like Brit Smith's version because it's her song, and I love it. And I know that there are some artists that don't write their own songs, but I'm happy to see that the actual artist who wrote the song got to release it. And now she's top three. Go her! I love it. And I'm so happy for her. And I love this. And I love the song. And, but I'm not saving her version to my Spotify. I'm saving Brit's version. Brit's version is saved to my Spotify and not Jodeci Sorry, Jodeci but I saved Brit's version. Anyway, that's all I'm going to talk about because I do not want to cause... Drama. Just gonna say, Brit's version, I saved to my Spotify. That's all I'm gonna say. And now I'm making my coffee because I need it. And then I'm gonna clean the coffee machine because I need it. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna add ice to that in a minute. Now we need to add ice to our coffee. I'm sensing that people don't know how. Make wine. I'm just gonna do that just quickly now. And I'm getting a cry from my stomach. Um, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Do not worry about it. We've got more ice. Let's see if I can get this in the fridge without spilling a single drop. There's got to be like a hole in it. Like how is it? Like it's level, it's flat. Where is it coming from? There's got to be like a hole in the bottom or something. Because like I do not know. Yeah, like it's dripping. Anyway, yeah, like we're just going to ignore the holes in the bottom. I don't, I don't see a hole in the bottom. But anyway, I dripped anyway. I don't know how I did that, but <laughs> I don't actually know how that worked. Cause, like I dried and wiped the bottom, and it was still dripping, so. and I didn't even tip it. So. I'm not sure, but I got water basically everywhere. But it's okay; it's dry. And we, if you're wondering, we used to have like another one that was hard to open, but I actually can't find. We actually broke that. My sister did, so that's why we no longer have that one anymore. But. Where are we? So we had like two, but now we only have one because the other one is broken. But anyway, that's okay. Cheers. I didn't film anything yesterday because I actually just hung out with my mom. We went to the city and we got some shoes. And I'm going to show you guys them. I'm not going to tell you guys why I bought them yet, but I'm going to show you guys them and you guys can decide. Because we were looking at... Oh my god, I got a story for you. So... These shoes are only like 200 and something. These ones. Look at the packaging. Isn't that so cute? They're from... Whatever that says. Anyway. So yeah, the packaging is adorable. But the original... the We went into a different store. And we looked at the exact same pair of shoes. The exactly same pair. But they were $1,000. Because the actual banding around it was Swarovski Crystal. That's why it was $1,000. Where these ones aren't. Which, you know what? I don't need to. She put them in. Oh my goodness. Okay. So I don't need to ask you crystal, but this is what they look like. Oh my gosh. This is like, this is the branding. If anybody wants to know, but yeah. So the original pair that I tried on was Swarovski crystal around here. Like this bit was Swarovski crystal. So that's why it was a thousand dollars. But this pair was only 200 and something dollars. Cause it is not Swarovski. 
because I do not have a thousand dollars just buy on shoes. I'm going to like a fancy, I'm going somewhere in the summer, so that though, in the winter, but yeah. I'm going somewhere, so that's why I just, I'm not gonna show you guys where I'm going just yet, just because, you know. But I'm gonna show you guys what they look like on because I think they actually make me so much taller. And I can actually, surprisingly, hold on, let me just put this one on just so I can see the difference because surprisingly, they're a little bit taller than what I usually wear, but actually, I'm having no issues walking in them. None. I was going to originally wear wedges with the dress, but no, I'm not now. So, sorry, I'm just trying to, like, set this camera off. But walking in them is actually very, very easy. I'm also not a pro. Not a pro walker, but this is what they look like. This is the heel. Hold on. This is what the heel looks like. These are gonna be like my new, whoa. These I think are gonna be my new like fancy shoes, but I'm not sure though. These are gonna be like my new bougie shoes, but I don't know. Anyway, I'm so excited because I can wear these with like loads of things. But then I also have like these. These heels did not go with a dress because they were um they're black and the dress is like a creamy colour, so but these ones are also really comfortable. These ones are probably a little bit easier to walk in, but those ones are actually surprisingly quite easy to walk in as well, so I'm very, very excited. So yeah. So yeah, I'm so excited. But now I'm just like I'm not a really I'm not a high heel girl. Like I don't just go out in high heels because I don't know. And so but I think that if I was to ever get invited to the fancy event any brand wants to take me anywhere, then yeah, these are the shoes. These are the shoes that I'll be wearing. These, these glittery ones. But yeah, I love them. I'm gonna enjoy them now. Yeah, the shot of me walking them. I do a circle. Can I bust it on the dance floor? <laughs> I, I can. These are actually so beautiful. why they just flung out is because I, I took them out. But yeah, they're great. I love them. Can we just take a minute for this box? Like, you cannot tell me that this box is just like, the most prettiest thing you guys have ever seen. It's so pretty. And then I'm just going to put these two shoes this one on top because I don't, I, don't I don't have any room for it. No, I really want to find like an excuse to wear these because these ones are also really, really pretty, but these ones just didn't go with the dress. I know, this size 5, but they actually fit me perfectly, because this style, I was trying to find one that was like this style, but, but I couldn't, they didn't, when I did find it with sparkles, they didn't have it in my size, but I like the pair that I found, but yeah, now I've just got to, um, I'm going to find an excuse to wear high heels now, because like, it'd be weird just to go out to like the shops in high heels, or it'd be weird just to, you know, go out in high heels, I feel like you need like, an event, but I don't really have an event to go to, so... Anyway, I'm going to make myself coffee because I actually haven't had coffee yet today. It's because of that. I can't be trusted anymore. I was jumping on bed really fast, like getting on the bed really fast because I um, was trying to make a TikTok. And as I did it, I hit like the, my shin, my, no, what do you call it? My ankle on the bed. <laughs> Guys, I'm surprised my ankle is still lovely. I'm surprised, I'm surprised they're still here, anyway. I'm not really sure how this works, but I can make, someone can make the most aesthetic video, the most aesthetic, amazing video, and it like gets like maybe a thousand likes, <laughs> or maybe even less. But I can make hot mess video, like a video that just like doesn't make sense, it just is crazy, and I get like 22,000 or like a million views. <laughs> I feel like when I put more effort into making a video and I put more effort into making things, it just doesn't get as many views when you put more effort into it, which is just like kind of sad though, because sometimes I do try so hard to make a video like good and it just doesn't end up like getting as many views. So being a hot mess is really paying off, but yeah, I don't know what to say, just like what?
like how does that even work like how can I make a video that I think is fabulous and it took time and effort in and then it doesn't get many views but then I put it I make a video that like took me like one second to make and it gets <laughs> anyway thank you so much for enjoying the hot mess express i love that don't forget to give a giant thumbs up don't forget to subscribe like comment share and i'll see you in the next video don't forget to be like kind of beautiful and don't let anyone say you're beautiful good night sparkles good night